a time bomb is ticking beneath the surface of many European seas. Countless pieces of rusting munitions have been lost or intentionally dumped on the seafloor during the course of the 20th century. The location of these deadly dumping grounds is often poorly documented. It's estimated that German parts of the North Sea and the Baltic Sea alone contain some 1.6 million metric tons of relic munitions. These conventional and chemical weapons threaten human life and the marine environment, endangering fishing and navigation, impeding development of offshore energy, aquaculture, shipping, tourism and other sectors of the blue economy. The European Union is supporting research projects that aim to find and clear undersea munitions. This underwater drone is used to study the Kohlberger Haid marine dump site in the Baltic Sea near the city of Kiel. In this area alone, we can see some 30,000 tons of rusting sea mines, aerial bombs, torpedo heads and other munitions dumped in large piles or scattered on the seafloor. These crumbling chunks are exposed pieces of TNT and other explosives. They slowly decay, releasing harmful substances into the seawater, including cytotoxic, genotoxic and carcinogenic chemicals. Various countries routinely dumped obsolete or unusable munitions, conventional as well as chemical, in the sea until 1975, when it was forbidden by the London Convention. Today, with growing shipping traffic and accelerating development of offshore pipelines, wind farms and aquaculture, it's urgent that we understand the scale of the problem to find ways to deal with it.